This year, the Midland League track and field team will have two athletes represent the Rebels for the first time since 2011 at the state track meet. But don't be fooled by the eight-year low, because Paige Low is going for the gold. Throwers, throw. Oh. And Midland Lee's Paige Low is looking to be one of the best in the Lone Star State at doing it. This is so much fun. I love it so much. Paige is actually so good, she's heading to state for not one, but two field events in shot put and discus. It's a really big deal. Uh, one event just in itself is a big deal, but two I think is really special. And Lowe's coach, Frank Maldonado, isn't surprised. It's a really special thing, but again, it's a credit to her work ethic and her attitude and all the time that she's put into it because she's put in a lot of time. You may ask, what's made the difference this year for Paige? Speed, speed, speed. That's one answer, but the other is something bigger than us all. Um, I want to do my best for Essence, and I threw with her, I played basketball with her, so um, I think that this year everything is dedicated to her, and that uh, it'll continue to be like that, but especially this year. So Lowe may have the edge with a guardian angel looking over her during the state track meet, but the junior might not need it. She heads to Austin, ranked first in the state in shot put, throwing a 47-6, and in discus, throwing a 157-6. First place would be amazing, but I think just placing the top three would be a huge deal as well. That's a winner, winner chicken dinner right there. So the stage is now set. All that remains is letting the thrower throw. Now the UIL state track meet is supposed to start tomorrow at 8 a.m. The weather in Austin right now might not cooperate, but the 6A events, which Paige will be participating in, will begin on Saturday. So from all of us here at CBS 7, Paige, go get two gold medals.